Before I start my presentation, I'd like to show a short clip. What did you think about our video? It's amazing to talk about our brand recalls to you all. Let me tell you about the fashion industry before I talk about recalls, the brand. We all know that fashion always goes together from our lives. It is the third largest industry in the world the fashion industry is a $450 billion market. It also is the second largest polluting industry as well. It causes environmental issues, and there are many human rights issues as well. Fast fashion online purchasing are current trend. Things change so fast. The point where it causes serious dead stock issues. This is a parent company incinerator. Huge amount of products gets incinerated. As fashion rapidly changes the product, then we need to depose also grows accordingly. So we wanted to do something about it. The idea started eight years ago. We wanted to solve the problem we caused. We wanted to find a solution that was the most fashionable. That's how Record started. Our philosophy is this is not just fashion. We aim to design newness without waste. Lee means the recreate design inspired by, a, inspired by a revolutionary thinking. Code means the new culture beyond the fashion, spreading the value of sharing and environmental concerns. For the time we have, I'd like to talk about our five brand keyword, product line, our movement to retable, and lastly, the places you can find us. Brand keyword. Our brand keyword is eco-friendly. Every year tons of clothing gets made and thrown away. Some are brand new, but not selected. And that is a fact. This hurts the environment, and that is also a fact as well. We use these unselected products to create new value. Unique design. Each record designers go through the data stack. We select the best product for their fashion concept. We take apart the outfit and 
stitch them together and create our unique record style. This is an example of a men's jacket becoming a woman's lifestyle vest. Handcraft. Many do not know, but it is more difficult to tear things apart and recreate. However, this is something common to record designers. We work with experts who know what they are doing. We collaborate and add our aesthetics, inserting practical functions to create each garment. It takes more time and effort, but this handcrafting makes record much more valuable. Limited edition. All of our products are one of a kind because we have a limited amount of dead stock that we can use. The number on our label means how many garments we made. For example, if there is a number eight, that means there is only eight pieces created in the same style. Social project. Other than in artisans we work closely, we also work with the social minorities. We support talented individual designer and them a chance to grow. We body up with the handicapped, single mothers, and refugees, including the people from North Korea. We try to give them a chance to stand by themselves. Now, the important part. I'd like to talk about our product line. Record main collection carries three categories of fabric line. Inventory, military, and industrial line. The first is our inventory line. We use our parent company's sportswear, men's suit, and casual wear dad stock. I personally find this masculine line transform into women's wear very fascinating. Because you cannot see these design details in other women's wear. The left is inside of a men's jacket, reversed, transformed into a woman's wrap shirt. Record designers like to reverse garments. The outside of an outfit can be the outer and vice versa. The men's inner jacket pocket and label design is something other brands cannot easily mimic. The right uh, is a combination of denim parts and suit fabric meshed together into a skirt. Casual fabric and mixed with formal fabric is a common technique you can find in record designs. This one. <laughs> this is also from our inventory line. The raft is a woman's coat. We take apart a men's waterproof coat and added a fluid feminine fabric to make it. The dead stock itself has a very tough masculine feel to it. There was a lot of thought put into it in order to make the garments more feminine. I was happy that this garment was loved by many. On the right, this is a woman's woven top. We dismantled a classic men's shirt and connected the sleeves to the sideline on the bodies, creating an A-line silhouette. These sleeves were from our main collection leftover stock. This is, is a, an example of an outfit created entirely from the combination of daddy stock garments. The second is a military line. We use military tents, uniforms, parachutes, and other materials. On the left, we recycled a camouflage uniform. We have cut it into stripes and patched it together. The right is a men's jacket 
made with a military parachute, parted with an inner lining. Par parachute as a fabric is thin and delicate. Authentic care is necessary when cutting and sewing. That is why we use padded inner lining when we use parachute as a fabric. When we utilize used military tents, we spread it on a wide surface and cut apart, then we can use by hand. Military tents are thick and sturdy. Because of these characteristics, we create apron or turkeys for heavy duty work. This is our third line, the industrial line. Has anyone seen an actual airbag? Nobody? Nobody. <laughs> Hope you never have to. <laughs> Hope you all are an excellent free. Happy New Year. <laughs> Our parent company has an airbag factory. The airbag we use are defective. It failed to pass the tough safety test. But it has its sterling stitches and color scheme. Airbag coated to block air escape so we use this material to create bags and slippers that could benefit from these functions. You've met our main collection so far. We use that stock outfits from our parent company in order to create our product and realized that we too had wrapped over garments and trims. This made us create our Linanu line. It's a line for the general public that pursues zero waste fashion with a reasonable price. Let's see. This t-shirt has a patchwork detail from leftover belts and straps from other outfits. This is a woman's top created with immense jacket interlining. We believe that waste can be beautiful. This is why the Rina Rhine has this artistic patchwork. After dismantling that stock, we obtain leftover labels. Each label contains a different brand's sing signature and story. When we combine them, it becomes a fun and unique graphic design. We pass it on a bag or t shirts and create a record unique item. We all have that outfit in our closet that we never wear. Certain outfit may be out of a trend or it may carry sentimental value. After one-on-one -on -one consultation and personal measuring, we create one-of-a-kind garments using your own outfit. This premium of cycling personal rice service is recollection. This is presented to the customer with its customized label and a letter that describes the product process out, out that outfit. There is an outdated husband jacket through the recollection service. We create the wife's jacket. Another interesting recollection project was a hanbok upcycling project. Hanbok is a traditional Korean outfit. Most Koreans have one or two hanbok in their closet. And wear hanbok for family events, but we don't wear them regularly. The donated traditional hanbok was reborn as a modern garment. As a designer, it was a precious opportunity to learn about the value and beauty of Hamburg that was forgotten. We try to talk about Rico's environmental messages to the general public. This led us to retable our upcycling workshop. These are some of the retable workshops we did in Korea, Germany, and France. This is a clip from the famous Seoul Design Festival retail workshop a month ago.
using dead stock and vintage sweaters, each participant made two Christmas pom poms. They were to take one home and donate one to a refugee organization. About 500 people participated in this workshop. Anti-fashion project is an event held in Marseille, France, that rethinks the current fashion industry. Record was the only Korean brand invited. We held an exhibition, workshop, and lectures. This is a retailable workshop with Romanian artists and art gallery in Korea. The color white and red we considered prosperous in Romania. We upcycled our white and red data stock and create mobile art. This retailable workshop was held in Munich. Germany was a divided country just like Korea. We wanted peace and no more military. We wanted, that's why, we upcycled military uniform from all around the world to create a customized sewing kit. This is a 100 people retailer workshop where we made calendars with Ecovax. Record maintains a lasting partnership with refugees living in Korea. We developed and sell bracelets that single mothers can make at home, allowing them to work at home. The proceeds go to refugees. Now, places you can find us. Mainly, we have two locations in Korea, communal art space and upcycling at rear. At our communal art space, we have a professional library related to upcycling, an audiovisual room, and a workshop space for the general public to participate in. This is a non-profit space that operates mainly for the purpose of spreading the value of record. Upcycling at the rear. Record's main at the rear is located outside of Seoul. There is a pattern maker, sewing masters, and a dismantling craftsman. We provide them with a steady amount of work and allow them to focus on their work in a present environment. We have a Rico's flagship store in Itaewon, Seoul. You can purchase limited edition Rico's garments here. You can also meet our 2019 Spring Summer Collection in the States, China, Japan, Kuwait, and in Hong Kong. In Hong Kong, you can meet us at a big IT store. In this year, we will open our store in K11. So, what do you think about Rico's story so far? We will continue to work towards sustainable fashion this year as well. Talking to you today is our first event of 2019. I was so happy to do so. Hope you enjoyed it too. Thank you. <laughs>